Tonight at 8.30, cancer concerns in your shampoo. Last night we told you about a chemical found in some popular shampoo known as cocomide DEA. But another chemical found in many shampoo products that sounds very similar is causing lots of confusion. Now, people have been flooding our Facebook page asking what is the difference and what are the specific dangers? We sent Crown Force Scott Rates to investigate the issue. It's found in hundreds of shampoos, soaps, and cosmetic products. We're talking about cocamine MEA, and chances are you will see it in the ingredients label on your shampoo bottle in your shower. But what is it? And how much different is it than cocamine DEA, a chemical that has been shown to cause cancer in lab rats? They're related chemicals, but they're not the same. It has many of the same properties that cocamide DEA does, and that's one of the reasons why it's replacing cocamide DEA in these products is because it provides some the same functions um, and hasn't been identified as a cancer causing chemical. Both chemicals are made with a reaction that starts with coconut oil. However, it's a slightly different chemical reaction that makes cocamine DEA different from cocamine MEA. So it would appear that cocamine MEA is a safe chemical, right? We don't know whether we should worry about cocomide MEA being a cancer-causing chemical in the same way that cocomide DEA is. And the reason that we don't know is because those tests have not been done for cocomide MEA. But it, it points up that um, the system for testing chemicals and regulating chemicals really needs to be fixed. And with so many different chemicals out there, it's hard to keep track of which is safe and which is not. And that's why the California Department of Health has set up this website. It's a site that you can go to to get a list of proven safe cosmetics. We have also set up a link to that website. Just go to our homepage, cron4.com, and click on the story. Reporting in the newsroom, Scott Rates, Cron4 News.